Good day, good people. Today's affirmation is, I draw into my life peace, joy, and happiness. You might roll your eyes and think, well, really, what's that? Those things are powerful. They are essential. They count more than you might even want to believe. But think about it. I, I'm, I have to put in the perspective of now, the era we're living in, the time we're living in, the season we are living in with this COVID. It's killing people. We don't even know what it's caused by. Now we know that COVID has been around for centuries. This is just a different strain that is killing us like flies, right? What is peace? What is joy? What is happiness? I feel that differs for everybody. There's a general consensus of what peace, joy, and happiness should be. But think about what would make your day wonderful. Let's go with joy. What, what will make you joyful? Some people might say the sound of my daughter's voice because I'm stuck in Memphis and my daughter is in Africa. I would love to see her and hear her voice in front of me. A hug. A hug. That can be somebody's joy. That can be somebody's peace. That can be somebody's happiness. Sinking your teeth in a juicy mango could be joy. A quiet house. And a quiet house with beautiful soft music streaming through. Or just the sound of your children playing in the distance or just being in a space where there are no triggers there are no disruptors nobody's hating you nobody's arguing with you nobody's making your life miserable or things are not there's plentiful money there's there's an abundance of whatever you want that in itself will give you peace that in itself can give you happiness that in itself can give you joy so what's your peace, joy, happiness, and love? Feeling loved. I draw in joy, love, peace, and happiness into my life. Not just today, every day. Every day. And sit with it and deliberate on it and think of what joy, peace, love, and happiness would mean what is love to you there's no other love like a parent's love my parents I miss them the love they gave to me to me and my siblings unconditional and in this time I wish they were alive and this week Thursday is my dad's birthday so guess what I'm going to do? I'm taking that day off. And I'm going to get myself a skinny cappuccino and either a lemon meringue pie or a chocolate, whatever this coffee shop that I'm going to go to has to offer. And I'm going to celebrate his life and take that day off. It will give me peace. It will give me some sort of joy and some sort of happiness. So take your time and think about what gives you joy. My garden is a desert garden at this point. I'm going to have to get it done, laid again, watered so it's green. But having a green, lush garden gives me peace. Gives me peace. So when you say, I draw into my life, love, peace, joy, happiness. Know what you're talking about. Know what you're talking about. Some people leave their Christmas trees up all year round. Don't make fun of them. That gives them that their happiness. And you know what? There's a South African celebrity who 
always has a Christmas tree. Uh, he has his Christmas tree up. I've, I've grown so accustomed to it that I didn't even think twice about it. But today he had a post and he had a whole line of products from Le Creuseux. Creuseux. They sell cast iron um, pots. They're known for cast iron pots, but they have a whole set of culinary tools and equipment they sent to him. And he had them around his tree. And he said, you see why I don't put my Christmas tree down? Because I get gifts. I get gifts. It is like I felt he was saying that you have to believe every day is Christmas. You have to keep joy in your life. And what, what does that joy bring? It brings gifts to you. It gives you love. It gives you happiness. It gives you peace. If you saw the amount of products he had around that tree, I draw love, peace, joy, and happiness into my life. And know what it is each word means to you. A hug. A hug from someone you like. Not just any random person in the street and stuff like that. Yes, some people want, don't mind that. But sometimes you want that person who is for you. A hug from them. And sometimes people are living with those same people but are not getting that think about that so when you say these words make sure you have identified in the moment each day what happiness joy peace and love would be to you or means to you in the day in that day or the week or the month or the year or all the time it may change it may not change so I draw into my life Peace, joy, love, and happiness. I draw into my life joy, peace, love, and happiness.